Hi, in this video I'll be showing you this. It's the Vikicon beard and body hair trimmer. And what I want to do today is to show you around the trimmer, some of the features and benefits that it offers. And also, I do need a shave, so I'm gonna have a quick go with it later to see how well it performs. Just for a start, I would appreciate it if you subscribe to my YouTube channel, just give us a quick thumbs up. What I do is I talk about household appliances, do special in vacuums, and there's normally a bit of tech in there as well. So first of all, we just need to get it unboxed. And I know it doesn't mean a huge amount, but I'm really impressed with the packaging. It's nice, thick cardboard. Uh, I suppose that's a real advantage when it's in transport, uh, arriving to your house, then at least you know it will arrive safely. So first of all, we've got the trimmer itself. Uh, this is the first time I've got this out, and I must say it feels really nice. It's pretty lightweight. Anyway, next in the box, we've got the different size combs. Uh, I don't know if you can see, I will get these unpacked a bit more in a moment, uh, but you've got the different sizes, so depending on how long you wanted your beard, or the, the hair that you're cutting, then you've got different lengths of combs on here. So that one is showing that's nine to ten and a half millimeters. You've got six to seven and a half millimeters. And then there is already one on here. And that one is two to three and a half. So we've got the USB charging cable. This is rechargeable trimmer. I must admit, I have used some in the past where they've been battery operated or even worse, they're the corded ones. And corded ones, I suppose nowadays I do find a pain. Uh, but even the battery ones, I have found that the, the batteries just don't last that long and it's quite annoying and it can get expensive if you keep having to replace the batteries. So I'm really pleased that you've got a, a charging cable and to charge it up. So once it is fully charged, then you get around 90 minutes of use. And on the whole, if you're using it for say two or three minutes at a time, you know, clearly at 90 minutes, that's really good before you need to recharge it. And the advantage of being a USB cable is that uh, I suppose it can get plugged into any USB socket, even if you've got, say, your laptop or uh, just a separate phone charger socket, then that's really useful. Uh, we've got a little carry case, so you can, if you're going away or if you just want to keep it in here, then that's really good that we've got that as well. And then finally we've got the stand, so I suppose if you, if you want to put it in your bathroom, then at least you've got somewhere to, to store it. And we've got a book of instructions. So there's quite a lot in here. I suppose it's covering quite a few different languages. If you follow me on YouTube for a while, you'll know I'm not a huge fan of instructions. Uh, I do quite like to work things out for myself. I've got everything unpacked, so we can start to look at the trimmer now. On here, you've got the on and off button on the front. That just turns it on and off. And the button above there, you've actually got a little LED light. So I'll just show you that. So you've got different stages of light, so that's the lower setting for the light. Press it once more, that goes to slightly brighter. And then to turn it off, you just press it again. And then to turn the trimmer off, you just press the button on the front there. I did mention that you do get three guide combs with it. I suppose, well, first of all, if you didn't want any guide combs, so if you just wanted to shave a certain area of your body, completely smooth then you don't put any of the guide cones on there so i'll just show you that just show you on, on my hand here so like that there we go so it's nice and nice and smooth now i promise i have got a towel underneath here uh, although i'm in the showroom i'm not going to leave hair everywhere so although i'm going to do my beard in a minute then I have got towel and I will clean up after me. So as I mentioned, you do get three guide combs with, with the trimmer. So the first one is this, so that's the two to three and a half millimeter. The next one you get is the six to seven and a half millimeter. And then the longer one you've got are the nine to the 10 and a half millimeter. Now, I think it's the right decision to only put these ones in. I don't think you need all of the steps in between. And the reason you've got two lengths, and this one you've got the six to seven and a half millimeter, is you actually clip it on and then you adjust it depending on the length that you wanted. So I'll just show you that. And the way you do it is you just pop it on there and it just clips into place like that. So depending on the length that you wanted, you can either just clip it down. So the first one will be the seven and a half millimeter and then pressing it down just reduces it down to the six. 
and on the back here if you just press that up then that takes it back to the seven and a half millimeter and it's the same on the other guy combs as well i'm going to have a go with this now uh, i do quite like my beard quite short this is really as long as i normally want it this is the way it starts to get a little bit itchy uh, so i'm going to start off with a three and a half millimeter but what i want to do is if it does still appear a little bit long then at least i can take it down to the two millimeter so let's have a go So my initial impression, that's really good. Uh, I must admit, I will go down to the two millimeter. Uh, it's uh, probably still a little bit long. The reason I looked over there minutes ago, because I've got a window of the showroom and somebody looked in and I think it looked a little bit odd, me having a shave in the showroom. But anyway, I'm still enjoying doing this. So let's go down to the two millimeter and see what this one does. Brilliant, absolutely love it. Uh, I must admit, having the, the plastic guide comb on here, it feels really smooth. Uh, the current one I use feels a lot more harsher, so I'm really impressed with that. Again, I do promise that I'm going to tidy up in a minute, because I've got some, some more beard hair on the floor. So now that I'm nicely trimmed, then I can show you how to clean and maintain the trimmer. Uh, the first thing you need to do is just to take the guide comb off here. You do get this cheeky little brush with it, so that can be really good if you just want to clean it without taking it apart too much. Uh, if you do want to clean it properly, then if you just, that's it, just open it that way. Uh, with these, it is IPX7 rated, so what that means is that it is shower proof as well. So when it comes to cleaning, if you wanted to give it a rinse under the tap or even trim in the shower, then that's completely up to you. That's another really good feature about this. And then once you clip that back together, then you're ready to start shaving. And clearly if you're gonna get it wet, then you don't want it to rust. So that's why we've got a ceramic blade on here. And also just let you know that it will actually cut at 6,000 RPM. And what that does is that's, that's pretty quick. I've had a look at other trimmers and that's pretty quick. And the main advantage is that it avoids the nicks that you can get, I'm sure whether you're man or woman, you know, if you've been shaving, then sometimes you get a little nick when, you, when you're trimming and that can be really annoying and quite painful. If you're thinking of buying one of these beard and body hair trimmers, I have provided a link below to show you where to get one at a competitive price. I hope you enjoyed this quick video on the Vicucon beard and body hair trimmer. I must say, I've really enjoyed doing this video. I know it's quite a quick one, but at least I got a bit of a trim out of it anyway. If you've got any questions on it, then just pop it in the comments below and I'll get back to you. Thanks for watching.